Hey everyone, it's your friend Think Noodles, and I'm here to show you how to use Tor proxy software to change your geolocation so that you can appear that you are in a certain country. Now I'm gonna show you how to specifically make yourself appear that you're going to be in the UK, but you could apply this to just about any country. You just have to select a different country and make the appropriate configuration changes. So the first thing you need to do is go to www.torproject.org. There'll be a link in the description for this. Click the download Tor button. Tor is a free software that you can download for Mac or PC or even Linux, and it'll auto detect what operating system you're using. So just choose which one's appropriate. Uh, for me, it's a 64-bit Mac, so that's the one I'll download. And just let it download. Now, once it's downloaded, you're gonna have to unzip it and install it. I'm going to assume that you already know how to install programs on your own computer. So now what you're going to do is launch the Tor browser program. This is specific to Mac. I'm not sure what it's gonna be called on a PC. So just double click it, and this control panel will pop up. And you'll wait a few minutes and it'll say connected to the Tor network, and eventually it will say connected to the Tor network, and it'll launch a second browser that looks like Firefox. So first let me show you that my IP address on a non-Tor is and I'm blocking out the IP address, but you see it's in the United States, country code region US, region New York. So now back to the Tor browser, and this one has a different IP address, which I know because I can see that, but if we go to geoiptool.com, you'll see now it says we are in the Netherlands. And that's great and all that it changed it. However, I wanted the UK, and the Netherlands isn't the UK, and the website that I want to visit won't allow me in the Netherlands or anywhere else but the UK. So if I go there from my browser to enter this contest, it tells me not available in your region. And it will do the same here. I'm not gonna waste your time. So what we need to do is we need to go back to Vidalia and we need to change some settings because we want to only be in the UK. And every time we launch this, it's gonna change countries. You might get lucky and get the UK, but that's kind of a pain. So what you do is click view the network. It's gonna pop up this window here. There's gonna be a lot of relays. Uh, in fact, it says 3,176 are online. So what you need to do is change this to sort by country. And you just need to scroll down until you see the British flag, that's Australian. And here we go. So now we have uh, a bunch from the UK and this left column here gives you the quality of the connection. So you're gonna to wanna to go with some higher quality ones so it'll be quicker for you. So look, what I would do is just take the top five or six. So let's remember their names and put them into a note. So we have Tor Land 1, Tor Land 2, Revisited, S-T-O-N-E-R-H-E-N-G-E, -E -E. stick it to the man and ham tour. So we have the six there. Now we need to edit the tour configuration file so that it will only use these nodes. And what you need to do is take these and put exit nodes in front and then separate them by commas. So let's just do that. Okay, so you'll see it's all in one line. Now. The second line, you want to put strict exit nodes, one. And the one is important because that forces it to use those exit nodes that we put up above. Now we just copy this to the clipboard and then we go to the Vidalia control panel. Then we click settings and I'm not sure how this is gonna look on a PC, but on a Mac, you go to advanced and go down the second panel where the Tor configuration file is. Don't worry about where it says, just click edit current Tor RC. Now it pops this up. Just paste your lines at the top there we go, so exit nodes and strict exit nodes one. Now I have a problem saving it and I think it's a bug in the program, so what you need to do is select the two lines you just pasted in and press this button, apply selection only, make sure save settings is checked and click OK. Then click OK and now it's gonna force it to use the new exit node. The only thing is we're gonna have to stop and restart it, so just click stop tour and Tor isn't running, so we can close a Tor browser, and we'll start it up again. 
Now what it's going to do is it's going to reconnect to the Tor network and it's going to use one of the six nodes that we told it to use. Now it might take a little bit longer to connect to the node because you're forcing it to use one of those six and it has to connect to all of them in the network first. So it's not just picking any node, but eventually it will get there. And there we go. Now it'll launch the Tor browser for me and it will check and here's my IP address, which is different from the last one. And let's check GeoIP tool com and see what it says about our region and there we go so it connected to the Torland one exit node and it shows my country is the United Kingdom so now all we have to do is visit that promotion and it will work because the server believes that we are now in the United Kingdom as you can see here I hope that helps all of you who are trying to use Tor to access region limited websites such as this promotion by Disney in the UK. If you could take a second to like this video and subscribe to my channel, I'd really appreciate it. See you guys again soon and thanks for watching.